once again. May the world praise this day. I have a shall shall shall. Shall. And give the words on us a person of great millstone that rule well. Come. Salutation to the brothers that push in this wood in sincerity and truth. That's right. This is the train that camp. Quam, the squad and the mad. Shalom. Come to do our video here this evening concerning the pride of the black woman. Come. Because we're going to the streets earlier on. I you know. See that these women and them when they they spend money on the hair and the nails. You know, they might do the toes. They might put on a, a new eyelash. Come. You know what I mean? The money they spend out for that, they, 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 they tell themselves, no, average dude mustn't tell them anything. You know what I mean? Come. What man? It says Isaiah chapter 3, verse 16. It says, moreover, Yahweh Baal Shem El Shai said, Because the daughters of Zion are hot, and walk with shed forth necks, and wanton eyes, walking and mincing as they go, and making a tinkling with their feet. Therefore, the Most High Yahweh will smite with a scab the crown of the head of the daughters of Zion, and Yahweh will discover their secret parts. Yeah. So all these, all these accessories, so to speak. But they, 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 add, they, they add into the, the, the body. When they buy all these accessories, they tell themselves the average dude must speak to them. They must even watch in the direction. Right? So these bitches begin to get proud. Can't. If they just say, wake up, your daughter, that are at ease. That's right. Right now, they're at ease. They, they, they love this kingdom that they're in here. This kingdom put them on high. Their pride is all lifted up. The scripture say you would scam, you would get them a scam on the head. That's why all the other nations could, could, could go with their hair going straight down to the back. And they all they all have to be with beads and wigs and all this bullshit. You also say you will cut on top of the secret path. Where is the secret path? The stink pussy. That they don't even know how to, to wash properly. Well, uh, can and if I could say something too, also because the way the, the dress code that they carry about that these women carry about these days, right? The hair they had the hair on reveal, they have the, the, the bosom, the cleavage showing the, the arms and the the legs, right? The scripture said that a woman should be dressed in modest apparel, right? Um, when you check up modest apparel, basically being fully covered, you understand, but. You know, they, they walk in, um, the scriptures say, your wife shall be harlots in the streets. Because why? They're dressing like harlots and the, the body being revealed. Right? Like if they're selling, the hey, you don't have a husband, you know. But you, 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 you selling property like if um, it's a window shopping sale and you don't have a husband. Like wickedness. Right? It's going ahead. Verse 18. In that day, the Lord will take away the bravery of their tinkling ornaments about their feet and their coals and their wrong tires like the moon the chains and the bracelet and the mufflers the bonnets are the ornaments of the legs and the head bands and the tablets and the earrings the rings and the nose jewels the changeable suits of apparel and the mantles and the wimples and the crisping pins yeah, so when, 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 when you take off all these things, because some of these women, some of these women, when they're done, how they say, they, when they're done, chance for, you, because I, I, I see certain articles that a, 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 a woman, a woman as ugly as a chimpanzee, when she done put on that makeup, she was Miss World. So all these, all these accessories, the most I see, gonna take it away. Step back up where you see. Um, that at time on, on Facebook, this man, he married a, a woman. She was well beautiful and stuff like that. And she came into the room and saw her take off. You know, and she, she normal. No, no earrings, no makeup, nothing. And the next few days he divorced her because she was looking beautiful at first and, and she looked very ugly when she took off all these things. Yeah. 
You understand? Yeah. Uh, talking about that, I saw the next one where a man married a woman, one pretty as a as you could get. And all the children come out looking like as ugly as hell. Mm. And what happened? You want to take a plastic surgery to beautify yourself. She was ugly like hell before. She wanted to take a plastic surgery to do certain things on her face. Can't. But that ain't going to change. She, 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 you understand? She makes sure that ugly like hell and the man wanted to know what was going on. You understand? And he divorced her after that. So this man married a guy boy. <laughs> um, verse 23, the glasses or, or mirrors and the fine linen and the hoods and the veils and it shall come to pass that instead of sweet smell there shall be stink and instead of a girdle a rent and instead of well set hair baldness and instead of a stomacher a girdle of sackcloth and burning instead of beauty. Yes, so they're going to be in that day. There's nothing no beauty, you know, um, saloon to go to to make up your, your, your face and all that bullshit. Because they claim to say, they just claim to say that they want a, a, a real man. But nothing on them in real. You can't. You know? Um, it says, thy, thy men shall fall by the sword. And I might and I mighty in the war, and her gates shall lament and mourn, and she being desolate shall sit upon the ground. Right? And so that was talking, that basically talking about the world wars, right? And the final world war, which is World War Three to come. Right? Because in that day, you understand, um I say I'll tell you to Anna. This is Isaiah. Thirty-two, verse nine. Says, "Rise up, ye women that are at ease. Hear my voice, ye careless daughters." Yes. Yeah, so you know, at, they were at ease because of all these ornaments and these jewels that they had. Right? The 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 heart of the, the, the daughters of Zion was lifted up. Fourteen, meaning proud. Right? And you know, um, so like here, 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 some. Idol worshippers next to us, two thirds, just in case if you hear any, the name JC, right, Baba Kasha Selakia, right, they just find, you know, the devil just find himself, you know. Where that bag of noise coming from? Can. Uh, where the bag of noise coming from? Baba Kasha Selakia, Kalakia, right? So, back to the um, precept, right, because the scripture said the daughters of Zion was 40. So, guess what? They, 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 in this state now, that, you know, they, they at ease. Right? They they making they making money, they making the dollar bills and so forth and so forth and they have two, three, four men and Christianity promotes that. You understand? But the how about Shame the God, the true God he don't promote that that kind of shit, isn't it? You understand, go ahead. Because right, these, these 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 women are adulterous women. Right? Just just like the, the churches who worship pagan gods. Go ahead. I read it over from verse nine. Rise up, ye women that are at ease, hear my voice, ye careless daughters. Give ear unto my speech. Give ears unto the speech of the most high. Right? Not 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 speech unto the doctrines of men or, or what the pastors are to preach. But but give give heed unto the words of the most high Yahweh Shame Go ahead. Many days and years shall ye be troubled, ye careless women. For the vintage shall fail, the gathering shall not come. Right, the vintage shall fail, the gathering shall not come. Right, you know, um, my brother Koda do a, um, a video calling the vintage, right, shall shall fail or cease, right, which vintage goes back to the vineyard, right, or the economy, the economy will fail. So the, the time that, you know, the, the source of these women, um, the, the, the gathering or the coming in shall fail. So they, they'll no longer um, be able to gather certain things. So they'll no longer be proud. You understand? It says Ecclesiastes chapter 12, verse 2. Ooh, watch our fish. Go ahead. It says, In the day when the keepers of the house shall tremble, and the strong men shall bow themselves. Right. So, so the keepers of the house, 
right the keepers of the house goes back to these people who own parlors and shops and um businesses right these are the people um the keepers of the house right so you say when the keepers of the house shall fail go ahead in the day when the keepers of the house shall tremble and the strong men shall bow themselves and the grinding cease right the grinding cease grinding means what work scripture said there shall be no work done in egypt right so when that time comes when the the, the men can bring in the um the vintage for them right they, they these women they won't be proud no more right pennywise and all these places in trinidad and all around the world the cosmetic stores right they'll be shut down and that is where the stink will come from because a lot of these women out here they depend on these cosmetic stores to keep her ascent right uh, because naturally they don't know how to take care of the body right because why these women they, they are adulterous they have one husband but they want to sleep with Tom they can Harry and Harry Lala and he cousin and he back a man. Uh, you understand? Yes, yeah, so look up and should be all oh, the one. Why are looking for like this? This is um Surak chapter twenty six, verse eleven. It says, Watch over an impudent eye and marvel not if she trespass against thee. Yeah, ma marvel not if these women trespass against thee. Right? She 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 she's she, she uh, impudent mean a foolish eye. Right? When when you when you supposed to stick to one man, you, you, you have these different men. But that 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 is foolishness. Because we all know that what? Jealousy is the rage of a man. If a man, especially a godly man, a true godly man, was to come home and meet you, right? With our next man on top of you, we know the where the scripture say that both of you shall be put to death. Leviticus 20 verse. Give me 10. Leviticus 20 verse 10. Leviticus 20, verse 10, and it says, And the man that committed adultery with an other man's wife, right? So, you know what? Just just one fact the word adultery goes back to the Hebrew word zana. Right? So, next word, um, can't remember exactly what it is right now, but zana, right? When, when, when a lot of people think that sex before marriage is fornication with the word when they translate it or always goes back to um adultery or idolatry or an unclean act right so sex before marriage is not fornication right the word fornication goes back to adultery or idolatry so an adulterous woman a woman who commits fornication what this is um proverbs 30 verse 20 such is the way of an adulterous woman she eat it and wipe it her mouth and say it, I have done no wickedness. Yeah, so you know, a woman will now trespass against her husband, right? And say she done no wrong. But it's a foolish woman. Right? You think you ain't done no wrong, but the most I took record of that. A lot of you women who, who even go to church, right? You hire your husband and you, you might sleep with the pastor right. or sleep with another brother in the church, like wickedness. This society make it easy now. It is easier to get to commit adultery than a woman quicker gaining sex knowing that she can have a, a man child. And if you meet a single woman, she will take a longer period of time to gain some pussy. And if you meet a woman, that's a man. Can. In scripture say, um, come for the good man is not at home, he has gone on a long journey. Can. But this man journey, this man might forget some new woman come back with the tree line and chop you up. Right, go ahead with the, the Leviticus. Leviticus. Leviticus 20 verse 10. And the man that committed adultery with an other man's wife, even he that committed adultery with his neighbor's wife, the adulterer and the adulteress shall surely be put to death. Yeah, the blood shall be upon their own head. Then the commandments say thou shall not commit adultery. So That's even right. um Crypto Dollar, you fool who's saying that, that you um shouldn't keep the commandments. Right? Even the big ten. You have to keep the commandments, guys sure. You know? If 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 somebody to come and have sexual intercourse with your wife, right? Hey, you, you'll get upset. That that justice like truth. The scripture say hey, you people seek not after truth, no justice. 
how you could say you know that you don't have to keep the commandments but yet you want to keep tithes right want to rob the poor the people just so you could wear um a brand new kick and stab as we call it out here as spit and shine right a brand new suit and tie right um pay your bills by um benz beam and whatever the case is robbing the poor and you're delivering them up as a slaughter right and you you women because you women are the pinnacle of the churches right you you just love wickedness this is Proverbs chapter 23 verse 27. It says, For a whore is a deep ditch. Whore is a deep ditch, right? You, you, you like, you're like the hell and the grave. You're like Sheol or Shawa Al. You understand? Because all who run into an adulterous woman, guess what? You just love death. The scriptures say, Adulterous men um, shall not stop. Because why he's a fool. And you women just as foolish. Right? We, we, we saw a video. Some brothers sent that video. And um, we have a WhatsApp group. Right? Where, where a man basically chop up his wife there in Guyana. And then hang himself. He, he left the tree line or the machete within her hands. Right? And you know that. You know for sure. The only time a man will do a brutal death like that is if that woman committing adultery against a man because jealousy is the rage of that man. Right. But you, you women out here, hey, your judgment coming show. You, ju you women, your judgment coming show. That's something in for This is, um, is Proverbs chapter 6 and 32. It says, But whosoever commit adultery with a woman lack it understanding. He that doeth it destroy his own soul. Yeah, can you lack you lack discernment? You lack understanding. Then the scripture said, do, do because the scripture said if you commit adultery, what you should be put to death. Right? So you 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 lacking you you lacking um understanding, discernment to judge between the lines. That is where you're lacking. Right? They say something earlier on that um she always cry down to the pits of death or something like that. Can't. That you said we have a day, Proverbs chapter 2, verse 18. It says, I'll start at verse 17. It says, Which forsake the guide of her youth and forget the covenant of her power? For her house inclineth unto death and her paths unto the dead. Can't. Right? Because all the ways of an adultery is death. It's nothing but death. Um, this is Job. You know, Job chapter 30. Right? Because, hey, other than homosexuality, right? Um, adultery is one of the most hateful crimes in the eyesight of the most side. Right. That's right. You understand? So all these people who commit an adultery, whether it's spiritual adultery or, or physical the most I hate it right you people lack understanding right the scriptures say even the beginning of fornication is when somebody um make idols the beginning of fornication the Hebrew word Zana the beginning of all adultery right the scriptures say that most most I said he married on us can so if we go on serving any other God, is that hell like, is that the Can't. Fornication. That's right. This is um Job 31. It says Um Job 31 and start at verse 7. If my self had turned out of the way and my heart walked after my eyes, right? After what? After the lust of your eyes. Right? It says, and if any blood had cleaved to my hands, then let me sow and let another eat. Yea, let my offspring be rooted out. If my heart had been deceived by a woman, which is an adulterous woman, yeah. right? Because you wouldn't be deceived by a woman who don't have a husband, but an adulterous woman. Family have a man, you have a husband, you have a boyfriend, somebody having sexual intercourse. No, no, no. And she goddamn knows somebody 
eating that box or up inside of that hole. But what, you're trying to get that man into that snare and that trap? When it is, you, you, you think no one both all is sweet and they hear a knock on the door. Girl, who is that girl? That my husband. Girl, I thought you tell me. You don't have a husband. That is when they're being deceived. Right? That's why sometimes you just have to girl, you sure girl. Sometimes you just say, girl, you're too pretty girl. I, I ain't sure say girl, you're too pretty, you ain't have a husband. I get a blueprint. Can. You have to say she has a certificate for that one, because you know nowadays you have to check this she birth certificate to make sure she is really a, a woman all kind of thing. First, he's so nasty. Yeah, and this, um, the, the, the woman and them today, they're not heavy, adulterous spirit. Can. You know, the rest by the dress code. How does the carry about itself, they're not adulterous spirit. You know? Can. Yeah. Basically, the, the love to sin too. Easy to sin. You know, where, where a man and the Lord go think twice. Them ain't even thinking once, they're, they're just going in there. Come on, I have something to back you up. This is Job chapter 39, verse 17. Because Yahweh had deprived her of wisdom, neither had he imparted to her understanding. Right? So, yeah. What is the reason why they like to sin so much? Why is, why is, it, why is the reason why she was the first person to, to transgress the law? Because she have not wisdom, neither understanding. Be because guess what if you women had wisdom knowledge and understanding you would have never taken part of that forbidden fruit in the garden of eden yeah. right yeah. and these women and them they're not loyal it has be so watch me it has be amazing to see how easy them transgressing against the they was one can easy that is why you gotta be you gotta be firm you gotta be the car had these women and them kind of don't know ditch. Can. Yeah, they stand up firm and, 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 and put them in their place and thing, you know, because they, they for some reason, I, I, I don't get, I had two experiences. One, I was telling them brothers and them was coming down the road in a taxi, yeah, and a woman and she husband hugging up in the back seat, talking, kissing up, smooching up. And I tell the driver, well, um, I tell I use a, um, how do they say, I use a slam, like, um, Super, look, take that in super. And she come out from me, deep pop up she was. But if I told her, man, I think you hand long. She not do that, she not deep pop up now. And she come out there to find out why telling the driver. And making, um, talk out of that, I say, but she disrespecting she has one. Meaning talk to she. Come on. Let's have a quick script there, yeah. Right. Sirach 25 verse 24 of the woman came the beginning of sin yeah of, of the woman come at the beginning of the transgression or the law the law the law tell her don't do, do eat from the fruit right you, you're going and eat right because the, the, the devil is so called white man which a lot of people don't know Right? It, it just um it just goes back to the Hebrew word Nakash. Wizard or serpent, somebody in the garden of Eden. It, it wasn't a literal snake. Right? It, it was just somebody of a, a high intellect. He was he was more wise or crafty than the other beast of the field. Or a warlock or a, 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 a witch. You understand? Basically beguiled her in, in eating of the fruit and knowledge and good and evil which is goes back to basically the Zodiac. Right? The next thing too, Go ahead. you know really and truly, as much as we just say the woman, the woman does entice a man and so forth. If a man put on his foot, with that, with, with, if men really start to put on the foot with these women, I thought she would come to a, 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 a slow state of the body. The really and truly, the woman can't carry man and do nothing with the man to carry the woman. You know what I'm saying? You can't. You know, they say a stiff prick who has no conscience because a lot of men they just think with down so. That is the next thing. Or I say they, they, they really put on their foot and put up their loins. You can The world, the world would have been such a, a better place and like uh, even a tutor, I heard a tutor say that. He say if these women could have think the way how they look, right, meaning beautiful, the world would have been much, a, a so much better place. 
But you woman, you hey, pretty, pretty face, but bad character. That is you woman out here. That is why your judgment coming sure. The scripture right. say you, you, you adulterous woman counted as spittle as nothing, pure. No. You understand? You ain't even looking back, right? Anyway, let me just finish with this, right? It says, um, Job 31 verse 9, If mine heart have been deceived by a woman, or if I have laid wait at my neighbor's door, which a lot of you men do, right? Which a lot of you women allow the men to do, yeah. then let my wife cry unto another, and let others bow down upon her, right? So, so has thou done, so it shall be done unto thee. For this is an heinous crime. Hmm. Yeah, it is an iniquity to be punished by the judges. You could even go into the science of adultery. When a man and a woman come together, they become one. The, the body fluids come together, they, they interact. When a next man comes along, right? You, a woman body have the right pH right mean acidity and um and the right temperature for for bacteria to dwell up in there when the from men going up inside are they you start to get a scent and not only that the next man her body doesn't really react to that that man one time that is why the even the scripture says she shall not go on to another unless the first husband be dead yeah. good this is Jer jeremiah three verse one they say if a man put away his wife and she go from him and become another man, shall he return unto her again? But shall not that land be greatly polluted? That land be greatly polluted. Just about to put your soul. Can you say something? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, because why? A woman, a woman, um, the word, he the word husband or husband on the whole goes back to farmer. Right, husband man goes back to farmer. Right? Um if I can remember if I can remember properly the word for Eve, I forget the Hebrew. Can't man, remember this farmer. Huh? Man. Yeah, but it basically goes back to land of farm. Right? So so the most I compare in that woman to a, a piece of land. So if I'm next if I'm next man go there, the land will be polluted. Yeah, but what's something? A farmer farming an acre land. Why would the next farmer want to plant crops? Where he plant any crops? I can't, I can't, I confusion. Can. This is Ecclesiastes 36, right? Verse 24. He that get it a wife begin it a possession, a help like unto himself, and a pillar of rest, right? So the same way how a man will possess a piece of land, the same way how a woman come comes towards a man you understand and i help like let like me say if a man he go out there and he buy a piece of land how how the land come like a help it help him bring in what um b -b 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 crops or whatever the case is help him financially whatever the case is a woman supposed to be a, like a rest or a help on time and the scripture said that in um in the book of genesis That's something so adam was lonely provide help help for him this is Sarah chapter 26 verse 1 it says, Blessed is the man that had a virtuous wife, for the number of his days shall be doubled. A virtuous woman rejoiceth her husband, and Stop. he shall fulfill the years of his life in peace. Yeah, a virtuous woman means what? A strong woman. Then her son will give what? She, she husband rest, he rejoice like, yeah, boy. Woo! You know, sometimes. Hey, like like sometimes if if in this case you be a, a bachelor, you have to come home, you have to cook, you have to do this, you have to do that. But when it is you come home and you, let me say you marry a virtuous wife, she come home, she don't see about everything, the children go on and sleep, she cook, she 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 put your food on the table, she go on and bathe, she come home be get a massage, you eat, you understand, and then when she done, she just open that leg. You know, but you will not, but the girl will not come on your face. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, but it's not a can. plenty of men going through that. Can. Some men live in house of five and every morning that they, they go to work, that they go back, that they stand. Can. Plenty of them are be in, in a rum shop to get peace. Can. That will be basically in a rum shop every morning, morning, noon and night in a rum shop to get some peace. Because that dragon at home, 
making the life a complete misery. Fun. I don't understand. That's a brother. This is Sir Rock 26 with 7. An evil wife is a yoke shaken to and fro that he had hold of her is as though he had held a scorpion. Fun. But. But a man has to be going home and holding a scorpion, he will be rather not grown. Very rare, he will be going home. Fun. You know? These bitches need to get themselves in check. <laughs> you know it's so it's, it's so terrible for a man to have work and then go home and then that 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 work they are going to. This is the C this is the C seven and twenty seven. I'm going to replace the C seven. I'm going to replace the. You see, it says a drunken woman and a guarded a guarded abroad. Cause great anger, and she will not cover her own shame. Can you understand? Drunken. Could, could, could talk about literally always giving to the kindness, but also what drunk with different philosophies and doctrine. You understand? Read out that. It says. It says. Um, I have a, I have a precept here for you. It says a drunken woman. Yeah, that was I'll put up here. It's a drunk woman and a gather abroad cause a great anger and she will not cover her shame. If a woman jumping, if a woman drinking and getting drunk in the streets, obvious the friend man will be doing that with it. So well please skip this and she will not be cover she shame. Yeah, because hey, and that 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 was Christianity they have pushed too. Because why Christianity teaches you that basically, you know, you commit adultery, you, you go and pray. You understand that all is well. Like, you know, my wife was with the mask about her friend. Right? He he was he was delayed first. The, the the boy, the girl, right, was with um I think the boy cousin. Then the boy gone away into and into the states and then he started dealing the boy. They go on a church camp ah. Cause you know we don't celebrate carnival. Whoever go to church, they don't celebrate so called carnival over here. Right? So inside the church camp now, he 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 never had sex before. But both of them are having sex inside the church camp. They're not married according to the way they think marriage is. But she open she neck for saddest man inside the church. So they do the thing they this thing according to whoever. Boom. They're going on for a while. She asks for a break. Within the period of a break, but I can't even say a month or two, whatever, she get pregnant for somebody else. She get pregnant for somebody else all day. He didn't want to go back. With the girl, whatever the case is. But the Christianity, you understand? His family telling, telling him, Basically, like to forget that about the cases and accept back the girl. So he started you now. If to marry the girl, <laughs> according to the laws of man, you understand? And looking after the child. He looking after the child. You wanted a break. So Would he break it? Let somebody else break inside of you. And the man just breathe and, 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 just breathe and gone. Yeah. And he you now, like the jackass, will, looking after the child. And the girl was married. But what the scripture say? If a man to have a wife, that is um, Deuteronomy 24 verse 1. If a man to have a wife. So basically the church is and then that make. Yeah, the, the, the condoning adultery. The scripture says, say, so like, yeah, I'll get it. Deuteronomy 24 verse 1. I read it. When a man had taken a wife and married her, and it come to pass that she find no favor in his eyes, because he had found some uncleanness in her, then let him write her a bill of divorcement and give it in her hand and send her out of his house. And when she is departed out of his house, she may go and be another man's wife. Right? And if the latter husband hate her and write her a bill of divorcement and give it in her hand and send it her out of his house, or if the latter husband die, which took her to be his wife, 
her former husband which sent her away may not take her again to be his wife right basically that was their situation right after that she is defiled for that is an abomination before the lord and thou shalt not cause the land to sin which the lord thy god give thee for an inheritance so that is a sin that i that the christianity promoted forgive she i think it but who trespassed against who she was supposed to be dead see they 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 send things on emotions can you you ever hear about anybody taking any break between the scriptures la ah Right for me, bro. Right? That was not even no time, bro. Huh? Yeah, matter of fact, she is asking for timing. She always wanted timing. Right? This is um Titus chapter 2, verse 3. It says the aged woman, likewise, that they be in behavior, has become become at holiness, not false accusers, not given to much wine, teachers of good things, but that they may teach the young woman to be sober, to love their husbands, to be to sober, to love their husbands. To love your children. Not every minute you find and fault with your husband. Well, every minute you come off the bed. He, he ain't making up the bed. I always have to do this. I always have to do that. that is your duty. A man could help out in your household if he wants in. But really, that is your duty. Oh, he, got, he, he only does it up all set away as he leaves the drawers yet. Miss Lady is a woman. Right, go ahead. It says to be discreet, just keep us at home. Keep us at home. Shama ma bayat. Keep us at home. Not here, there, and everywhere. Not party, not excursion, not bus ride, not um, in the neighbor house every minute. Busy bodies. Not busy body. Matter of fact, you're supposed to be keepers at home. You're not even supposed to be on the work field. Because there is not the, the um the breadwinner of the house. And that is why the daughters of Zion are so proud. Because they could buy, as the brother is saying, they could buy the little false nails, the false eyelashes, the false hair, the false eyebrows, the false lip, the false this, the false camel toes, the false ass, everything on them false. You understand? And they're looking a little presentable, they're proud. He can't speak to you. This, 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 is this, this, this. very soon all of that will change you know, don't be proud anymore can arise you woman at, at ease hey teach your daughters lamenting the time going and come prophecies hey right now we see anything attention that some people laying game pay you know that going and cause hungry belly Hey, I was watching 2012 over again last night. The man called everything in an order. First, the job of economy, then the end of the dollar, then uproars, then this, then that, then the end. Man talking scripture. Because the economy had to drop first, then the dollar. Uproars are the people, looting whatever the case is. All of this have to happen. We say to other Yahweh, but Shami Al faith. Then as San Habakkuk said, he said, even though the fig tree shall not blossom, he rejoice. He glad, like, hey, yes, boy. Come on, that is bullshit. Can Jeremiah say, hey, let the die in the streets? For, for. The Jeremiah say, I do them good, boy. And these people seek to kill me, Lord. Kill them, the wicked. Come for their own good. Especially all your women in church who like to ball Jesus. No. Let we see what Jesus is going to do for all. Let us see what Jesus is going to do for all. Because Jesus ain't going to save you in that day. Can't. But anyway. So like, yeah, just, yeah, yeah, so, so, so like, yeah. right, there you go. Precept. Give me the um, Ecclesiastes 7 verse. This is Ecclesiastes 7 verse 26. 
and I find more bitter than death the woman. Find more bitter than death the woman. Go ahead. Whose heart is snare and, and net. Snare and net. Go ahead. And her hands are bound as bands. Go ahead. Whoso pleases Yahweh shall escape from her. But the sinner shall be taken by her. But the sinner shall be taken by her. Go ahead. Behold, this have I found, said the preacher. Right, King Solomon was the wisest man dwelling on the earth at that point in time. Until the time of Yahushai. For Yahushai said, Behold, one greater than Solomon is here. Right, go ahead. Counting one by one to find out the, the account. Because King Solomon basically was doing like a census. Go ahead. Which yet my soul seeketh, but I found not. One man among a thousand have I found, but a woman among all these have I not found. A woman, a woman amongst all these have you not found. Right? Go ahead. Lo, this only have I found. Go ahead. That Yahweh had made man upright that the most high had made man upright you understand because men we are the ones who will seek after and follow the laws of yahweh by shami right basically those women are long ago the judith the judith and these women ain't dwelling down here okay, hey take that in it these women ain't dwelling down here um sarah and these women they ain't dwelling down them women and them probably is still in the spiritual realm somewhere That is why we see new and new heaven and new it. Paul says, Best a man where he goes to our man. Wish about a man that you know. Still be as he. Be as he. He said, But this is trouble in the flesh, man. And I shoot it. Fun. Anything else? Yeah. Yeah, you know. Yeah, with that. You know, you say all praises to the yeah, Supreme, Yahweh Hashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the elders, the apostles are great millstone that surely do you well. Yeah. And salutation to the Akiam that push this with in sincerity and in truth. Right? JMS Camp, Shalawam, Kalakiam.